Hey, Sherry. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. Good. So you're a, a New Yorker. I am from uh, Long Island. Long Island, yes. <laughs> yes. So how are you doing today? I'm doing good, and I'm very excited to talk to you about stains and how you can help the, the people get, get rid of them in an easy way. Well, it's all about, you know, binding together for the slobs that exist coast to coast <laughs> and stain to stain. <laughs> so what are some good old-fashioned home remedies we can use to remove stains? Well, you know, um, red wine, uh, one of my favorites, uh, often I accidentally, given my name, of course, will spill some. And it's very easy to get out using stuff you have in your cupboard even. Salt. You put salt right onto the stain, let it sit there for a little while so it actually lifts the stain. Then, actually, believe it or not, Sherry, you put white wine on the red wine and away the stain will go. So very simple, easy, and again, after that, perhaps you want to think about drinking things that are clear, not that, <laughs> that will stay in your shirt or what have you. Uh, so that's really simple. Another one, too, is, you know, this time of year, we're starting to get back out in the garden, maybe get a little nick, a little blood, or your kids running around the park. Well, on the clothing, you can actually use your own saliva to get, it has to be your own blood, stain out. Pretty amazing, huh? Yeah, that is great. Yeah, so you try that out. If it doesn't work, of course, you can. You should also always do these things right away if you can, because the longer stain sits, the harder it becomes to get out. Another great one. Do you have kids, Cher? I do. I have two kids, and I was just going to ask my son plays football, and he's seven, mm -hmm. and his pants were completely ruined just from, you know, the dirt. Sure. Well, mud, for example, is, yes. is a yucko. I mean, it's, it, but there's an easy way to do it. Again, take a spud or a potato and you cut it in half, use the white side, which has the starchy stuff, and rub it on the mud stain and actually lift it. And while you're at it, bake up the other half so you can multitask. You can eat, <laughs> yeah, right, clean and cuisine, whatever you want to do. So that's a really good uh, way to deal with that. The other big one, because my son is a golfer, so grass stains. So for grass stains, again, using something handy-dandy, at least in my home and perhaps in yours, vodka. I don't know if you know this, vodka will take out grass stains. Wow. And if it doesn't share, just take a shot. I won't watch. I won't tell. <laughs> and it'll look cleaner, and so will everything else in your home. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, the thing, too, is that with all this stuff, it's terrific, but sometimes a stain is a stain is a stain. you got to bring in the big guns, the higher tech stuff. As much as I like to save the money, be eco-friendly, there, there's things we can use. And this is great. I do a lot of work with Tide. They have now Tide Stain Release. I don't know if you've seen these little things, but they're great. For I me, have. they're great. For me, they're idiot-proof, first of all, because they're pre-measured. Right. All you do is you chuck them, as you know, right into your washing machine. It will lift off the stain, and it works better than the in-wash powder booster. So you want to really try this. And, again, very manicure-friendly. Uh, you know, but one of the things, and one of the things I really admire about what they're doing here is the fact that we all, you know, hear these things and, they, and we go buy them and then a lot of them don't work. Well, Tide's doing something different. You actually can get a free sample or coupon by going to their Facebook page and try it and see for yourself if it really works. And while you're doing that, you'll also be automatically entered in to win a washer and dryer. Like yeah. that one, huh? Yeah, sounds great. That works for me. So, and w we can get that information on Facebook. Yeah, if you go to Tide's Facebook page, um, you'll get all the info you need. They'll get you a coupon or a sample. You can try it out, and as I said, maybe win that new washer and dryer. So, life will be a little less stain stain centric <laughs> for you. And is that part of the? Is that does that is that the stain challenge? Yes, it is exactly. It's called the Tide Stain Challenge because okay. they're challenging you to hey, okay, we're putting up or shutting up, or they are. <laughs> you know, <laughs> try this out. If it works, which it will, you know, then you'll know, and then go buy it. Versus you know spending money and wondering if something's going to work. They're giving you an opportunity for free. One of my favorite four-letter words. Uh, <laughs> you know, to try their stuff out. Great. Well, thank you for the great tips. I think um, I'll def they'll definitely come to use in my house. Well, good. And also, perspiration marks, right? You got some of those on stuff, whites. If you take two aspirin or four, it doesn't matter, let them dissolve in warm water, put the shirt in, away will go those stains. So try really? it and call me in the morning. <laughs> definitely. Thank you so much. All right, Cherry. Have a good one. Okay. Bye.